the the Smart Geometry Conference represents a great mix between the academy and the practice. This year, our our topic of material intensities is something that Demetrius and I were very um, interested in presenting uh, to Smart Geometry, a conference that has been geared primarily on the digital environment. We want to infuse that with a material logic. That's what we've tried to do here at this conference. I think I see for the the, the discipline of architecture a, a shift in the thinking or the shift in the logic for the way that we approach a design project. I think most other disciplines, um, the sciences and engineering, they understand a model as a, as a dynamic um, system. Whereas architects and the architectural tradition understands the model as a static representation of an idea. Um, I think the, the work that's going on at this conference at Smart Geometry uh, 2012 uh, represents a shift where m models of thinking in the discipline of architecture are becoming more uh, receptive and literally becoming more dynamic so that like the engineering disciplines we're starting to realize that architectural projects operate in flows even though they're static entities. Um, so the models that we begin to build to understand how they would exist in the environment need to be dynamic as well. This also gives us the opportunity to start communicating with these other disciplines in a more robust way. Hosting uh, Smart Geometry at RPI has been um, an incredible experience. Met a lot of amazing uh, people and you know I think uh, like I've, I've heard a number of people say the great the best part about the conference is just getting people together. It's the people that make the conference. Um, and the willingness of everyone to share their ideas and uh, their expertise with one another has made um, the experience of running and organizing the conference a, a real pleasure and a learning experience. Um, it's been fantastic.